Hey everybody, Austin here with another episode of my Let's Play series on The Binding of Isaac. So, after that horrible run last time with, uh, with, um, uh, Samson, we're just going to play as Isaac. You know, I just want to play with the D6 a little bit. Um, I'm also, since last time, I am on a different keyboard now, so I was beforehand, I was using my old... Dynex key or Dynex keyboard where now my brother let me use his older G15 keyboard so hopefully though it will be a much better experience for me. So we picked up our first item, poison damage, or uh, the common cold which gives us poison damage which I think would be an interesting tier effect. So we'll see how that goes. We got two bombs now so we will definitely use a bomb to blow up this tented rock. Hoping We'll have a much better run this time. Our, uh, we're only literally one kill away on Isaac before we will get uh, before we can get unlocked the D6. So I'm definitely excited. I think we can do it this time. I'm feeling lucky. And we have the Duke of Flies. So I think this Poison Touch is gonna be nice because it can allow us to do damage over time to our enemy. Oh, need to make sure I'm looking at the screen as I'm doing this so I don't take damage. But with the d damage, over the poison damage, I think that will definitely help us out in, you know, especially in taking Isaac, because it means we'll be able to shoot less tears at Isaac. Now I just need to make sure I'm actually damaging these guys. Doesn't look like poison damage is always going through. Now we'll definitely still want to get some damage, uh, damage up, so that way we can, uh, still do more per tier. Because it, because from what I'm seeing right now, you know, the poison isn't always procting. So we're still at Isaac base damage with the ability to occasionally shoot poison. Or to occasionally poison. Doesn't look like we fully poison all the time. Uh, need to get rid of these flies or get rid of... Alright, took a hit I didn't want to take, but that's alright. That's luckily what we have the spirit heart for. But still is trying to get... I already have the achievement for the first floor, but still would like to... You know, if you don't have to take a hit, we don't have to take a hit, which is good. But... Alright. Almost got rid of these flies. Cool. Cat of Nine Tails do not want, so we will definitely reroll you. And we'll take the range up. Really not much. I don't think we're gonna have enough chance to get another reroll, so we'll take that. Let's just clear out the floor real quick. Beggar. Yeah, especially with that beggar, there's no way we're getting a reroll. So I wonder, what's the case? So it, does, it looks like it's not every tier, tier does a poison touch, so I'm not quite sure what does and what doesn't. So we have one likely spot for the secret room. We'll go ahead and blow it up, see if we can get some money there. Oh. Yep. Three cents. So not a lot of money, but you know, still we're starting to build up that gold towards 15. So we will now continue on to the next floor, or once we get to the enemy, or the other room, we'll continue on the next floor, which we'll do now. So, so far I think the run's good, you know, I mean, common cold's not a, a drop I see often, I don't know if I just, I don't see it often, or if it's not common or whatnot, but definitely nice to have. Again, we're going to want to look at trying to get some damage up, get some health up, you know, anything to kind of help us with our survivability. Right, take that scent. If we can get some more spirit hearts, we might come back and play that. Help us get some money, you know, so event Kate might drop with a blood bank, a blood bag, which would give us more health and a speed up, I think. But right now we're at Isaac base speed, so we can we can stand just a little bit more speed, though we don't want to take too much more speed. If I can just get this guy. There we go, he's got poison. We now have a full reroll, so let's hopefully we find in the item room soon, which we just did. Excellent. So let's get rid of the most dangerous things there, those flies. Alright, he's poison. Good, good. And we got Ace of Spade. I believe that means we're more likely to get stuff to drop. A certain thing will drop more, I'm not sure what exactly. Game Kid we don't want, but we'll touch it so we get out of the pool. Reroll. Alright. 
Magic Mushroom, all stats up. That is a good pickup. We now have the ability to, we do, our tiers do more damage, we have more tiers, we have more health. Overall, good. And I'm liking this poison damage, because it allows me to, if it procs, I can just get in there and poison them and then get out. I can proc there, good. And with this all stats up, that's nice too. Cool, we got another key, so... Man, I need to get a bomb. I need a bomb so I can get to that. Alright. Because not only do we have a spirit heart there, but we also have a tinted rock. Alright, let's go fight our bomb. Boss. Larry Jr. Alright. Poison damage, I think, will be good here. Alright. Took some red heart damage, so we're now less likely to get a deal with the devil. It's a 1% chance, so it's... Still a little bit of a chance, but probably not going to happen. So stupid damage we're taking. Need to start hitting him. You can see here when you poison damage him, it poisons the section you hit. Alright. Hadjet boy. Unfortunately, we don't have enough to re-roll it, but we might get enough coins to go to the shop. Seven cents puts us at eleven. Let's go back and see if we can at least get that heart. I really would like to have a bomb, but we don't. I don't think there's really any way for us to get a bomb. We might be able to buy a bomb. Let us... we got that heart. Do I want to spend a full heart to get into here? Might as well. Nothing, alright. Let's see what's in our item room. And that will determine on whether or not I want to play that blood bank a little bit. Alright, we will definitely play it because we want the nun's habit. Be really dangerous here. Take us down to extremely low health. Unless we can get it to pay off really eat fast. And it did. But we still don't have the money. Ugh. This is bad because once the item's gone, we won't be able to see it. We won't be able to grab it again. Is there any way for me to get money somewhere? Alright. We're going to risk on there being some money in here, which there is. Excellent. That is enough for us to buy it. Now, can I... No bomb, so I can't bomb out, so we'll have to take another heart of damage to get out. It looks like we actually only took one in, one out, so that wasn't too bad. Alright. But now we have enough money, we can buy the Nun's Habit, which is awesome. Every hit gives a, uh, we t every hit of damage we take gives us three charge. Still can't get that tinted rock, which I'd love to, but this is gonna allow us to do, do a lot of cool things. Right, we've got curse of the labyrinth, so I believe that means this is a double floor. Nope. Bad dodging, but as you saw now, we now have... Oh, bad dodging there. But we now have a full charge. So we need to find some keys and find our item rooms. This room scares me, just because you never know where they're going to land. Hopefully we get a key out of this. Start shooting those guys. Well, we got a scent. And it found us a secret room. Alright. Not much we can do with that right now. One down. 
please drop us a key. Nope, a set. Alright. We need to find some keys. Keys are important for us, or else we cannot open up those item rooms and we can't do anything with this nun habit that we spent health to get. Alright. We need to be careful here, this room kind of sucks. From a dodging perspective. We may die. Ugh. Game be trolling because I can't get to any of those. Poison damage, do your thing. Alright. Give me a key, give me a bomb. Give me a scent, alright. We found our second item room. And we got a bomb. Excellent. So I can now we can now go back over here. And we can bomb you here. Get the health. And we got a key. Excellent. Alright. Now well, let's go and see what's in our item room over here. Well, detonator, we'll pick you up. We get six bombs. Set you back down. Reroll you. Into the... Is that the teleporter? Or doctor's remote, alright. We'll come back and we get a charge. We have at least one pedestal to reroll from now. I don't know how many more charges we have left around. Careful on dodging those spikes. And let's continue on in our search. Alright, well we have a full charge now, but we also only have one heart left. Ooh, that felt close. Right, two more to go. One more to go. Alright, let's blow up this chest. We get some health, some keys, a pill. Alright. What are you gonna be? Tears down. Alright. Not what I wanted. Not what we wanted at all. Maybe we can hopefully get something good out of this reroll. Deck of cards, alright. Easy ones. Gave us Empress, alright. If I had scapular, I could use that to infinitely get something like, until I can get something like the sun. So maybe we'll hopefully get scapular somewhere. Oh, almost dodged right into him. Need you to drop some health. Key, alright. At least allow us to go up to our second item room over here. At least really start seeing what's in it. Don't want to go to the shop because this is going to be based off the second floor, so the shop is more likely green. Shoop the whoop. Alright. Don't want. But we can at least reroll both those things now. And let us explore a little bit more. Alright. Need to find health. Pretty badly. I felt like I was going to dodge into one of them. Alright, two down. Two to go. 
Wanna go? Right, we got a key. One more room and we didn't have a recharge. We can go roll again. Okay, this room scares me just because these guys just shoot anywhere. And another key. Alright, let's go back and re-roll one of those items. Doesn't really matter which one we do. Book of Shadow, alright. We'll touch it. We're now more likely to get libraries, which are good because we could turn the libraries into double... Well, actually, let's do this real quick. Take Book of Shadows. Use it. Get the chest, which gave us the moon and a full heart. Excellent. We'll keep the moon for now, just because that's a sh teleport. I believe it teleports us to the secret room. Let us now continue. We have definitely more rooms that we can reroll. And I liked how we got that heart. So let's keep going through. Chest. Yeah, let's do it. Might have something good in it. Tarot card. High Priestess. Let's keep with the moon. Was that worth the bomb and a key? Probably not. Alright. This room is definitely scary. Do it like that though, but we got the golden key. If only we came here first. Alright, let's work on getting those charges. One more, and we have a full charge again. Alright, another key. Let's go reroll. Scapular, excellent. We now have infinite rerolls. Which is awesome. Basically, as we enter a room, if we down, get down to half a heart, it will give us a spirit heart. And it does it every time we enter a room, so we can use that to basically d keep damaging ourselves and get full health. Or not full health, but get infinite rerolls. Right, let's keep. These guys at a distance. Get some poison damage on them. Phew. Good thing he died or else I wasn't going to get by him. Got another key. Good. Alright. That was some bad damage. Those things I need to be careful of because they, they do a full heart of damage so they will kill me. Luckily got by him there. We got half a heart, which is good. And we're at a full reroll now, so let's head back to see what we can find. Definitely still looking at wanting to get some health up, wanting to get some damage up. Just anything to help us in our long term survivability. Range up. Uh, I think my range is pretty good right now. And I'm shooting pretty much the length of the thing, so we don't need the range up, so we will reroll that. Let us continue onward. 
There's only a couple spots where the super secret room can be. One of it being right here. Nope, all right. Another being here. Well, let's, let's clear out the floor a little bit first before we look again. Just in case there's any other likely spot. I have a feeling the boss room is going to be off of here. Yep. Alright. You be very careful here. Alright, as you can see we took a hit and we got a spirit heart. More bombs, all right. So we have a full charge again. Let's go ahead and reroll before we go fight the boss. And then we'll go fight the boss. And hopefully not die. We should, as soon as we get through that spirit heart, it should give us another spirit heart too, so that is good. Should not have shot those fires out, but that's okay. Oh. Did not mean to do that. Magnet. We definitely do not want the magnet. There's spikes here, but I believe those spikes will do a lot of damage to me. Let's see what happens if I do this. Yeah, cool. So I can get infinite charges off of it, alright. So let's, before we go back, let's just re finish rerolling this. Something we want. One up. Maybe. I want to see if we can get something better. Like a polyphemus would be nice. Go back and reroll. Skeleton key. Yeah, might as well. 99 keys, so now we don't have to we can open up any chest we run into now. Let's just get a charge ready. Or half a charge ready, so when we come out into the boss here. Actually, let's just go into the boss full charge. That way we'll be able to fully reroll, have a chance to reroll whatever's in there. Possibly the super secret room also. No, all right. Possibly here. No, okay. Possibly here. Well, actually, I want to get that heart. Blow you here. Keep a bomb in case we need it. Oh, I thought, thought I was at the boss. I guess not. All right, that was some bad damage on my part. And we got cancer. All right, I will take cancer. It's a fire rate up. And we're still not near the boss. All right. I totally misread that. our last bomb here. Some money up. It's not the health I was hoping for, but that's alright. This room scares me. 
Do some pr pro dodging. All right, down the one now. Poison tears came into great effect here. Now this is scary. Should be able to handle it though. Yeah. Very cool. All right, let's go fight our boss. The husk. All right. That's right. I forgot it's a double boss room. Be able to handle this not too hard. Doing some good damage to him. Poison damage is definitely nice. Yep. Now we just work our way through. This flies. All right. We will take this. Is it stem cells, which is a health up. And let's see what our second boss is. Pete. All right. Let's think of the champion version of Pete. Not sure what this champion version does. But we got some poison on him at least, which is good. And some good dodging. He seems a little faster. Dodges eye. Now there's two eyes to dodge. Oop, that was some bad damage. Bad damage there again. Come on, poison, do your thing. And we got him, cool. And another health up. Awesome, health is good. Let's go down to the next floor. Didn't really want to reroll those things, but it's okay. We're now on the depths, hopefully the depths and not ne necropolis. The depths one, awesome. All right. Uh, not really much I could have done there. I'm gonna try to find our shops, or our item rooms right away, because we can definitely re-roll them. We can also re-roll the shop if it is a shop. All right, down the three. Got a bomb, which is good. Needed that. And some more coins, alright. Need to kill these brains before they don't give me any place I can stand. Which are good now. More health. Alright. We want to... Let's go to here first. Harlequin baby, let's reroll. I think that's what, Mr. Mega. All right, so that increased our blast aid radius, which is good. So we want to set you here. All right, give me some of what I was looking for. Still got the spirit hearts in that. Ooh. Troll bomb. But we got bombs out of it for free. All right. Let us keep exploring. Alright, bad damage there. More money. We are rolling in the cash now. Bad damage. Lost our spirit heart advantage now, and we're taking our heart damage. Awesome. Might as well. And we found the secret room. Awesome. Health up. I think we want to reroll this. Pills. Alright, so now we have something that we can use our rerolls on. So what pill are we going to get here? 
We all know what this is. And eat them, alright? Let's see what's in our secret room. There's some more money. Let's keep that fire there. In case we need something to reroll on. Let's grab our moon card. And let's keep going. Simplified that quite a bit. And one more to go. Yeah, let's blow you up. More health, alright. Alright, need to make sure I'm taking these guys out. Actually, they seem, to be, they seem to be running faster than what I remember. Have I killed any yet? I don't think so. Alright, got one down. Stupid damage, which I can't afford to take. Can't afford to take any of that da stupid damage. Hopefully we drop some health here. Pill, all right. What is this pill? Bad gas. All right. Our moon card. Let's see, are you the secret? Oh, no, we've only been to the secret room. What am I doing? That was a waste of a bomb. Let's re-roll you. No. Nope. Oh, that was close. Make sure we don't step on the stuff there. Alright, got some more health. Let's us let's get one more room. And then we'll go in there. stepped on that. I should be able to kill him from there. I should be able to kill you. Oh boy, I was not expecting him to run like that. And we got more health, which is awesome. Alright, let's do another room. Be careful here. This can get messy quite fast. Especially with it being boom flies. Can easily set off a chain reaction, which we don't want to deal with. Oh. Alright, was not expect to not want to get that hit. That's okay, I think we're still going to come out ahead. One more. And safety cap. Alright, I think we want to keep a cancer. Let's go reroll. Click the cross. No. Let's keep. Let's just go fight our boss now. See what we find. Gish, alright. 
shouldn't be too difficult. Hopefully he drops the gish up. Awesome. Basically a championship version of the monster of fight. Let's keep him close to us like this. bad. Oh, we have a full reroll now. And he should almost be done. This has definitely shown me though how, I, how much I need some more damage up. Just because I am not doing a lot of... this fight's been going on too long. Alright, we got him. Oh, and apparently that was my first time fighting him, because now I got Little Gish. And we got the Little Gish. Excellent. So familiar shooting. Let's re-roll you. Limit mishap? Nope. Or not limit mishap. Get some more rerolls. Alright, that was some bad damage on my end. Alright. Ugh. Are you just my headphones hurting my ear there? Alright. Some bad damage here. Hopefully, I survive this. Chest. Five cents. Definitely cannot survive the uh, sh see curse room there. Three roll you. Or a Babylon. Let's see if we get another reroll or not. It looks like the gish thing shoots when it hits. It hits slow. It hits shoots slowing tears. Let's see what's in our item room. Probably more likely gre super greed. Okay, this could be the death of us. Luckily, gish familiar is helping out quite a bit. Pill is. Tears up, alright. So that realistically reverses the tears down we got before. We're now shooting some mega t fast tears. Let's re roll you. Okay, we're gonna might as well take it. Forever alone, attack fly. And let us go down to the next floor. So we need to seriously find some health here, or else we are dead. Maybe you are the super secret room? No, nope. all right. Let's go down to the, let's go down the next floor. Curse of Darkness, awesome. All right, well thanks to our uh 
thing. We now leave with a little more health than we had. Come on, full health. Health down. Are you serious? Dodging on this room is not fun. Let's bring it right into him. Alright, some more health. Let us continue. We need to find our item room so we can't waste this charge. The effect gish with my the effect of the gish tears with my uh, poison makes this so awesome. We just now need to get our health back up. All right. Well, because we fought greed, we know that can't be. So let's pay five cents for the spirit heart. Let's reroll you. Blue candle. Nope. Need to keep our D6. Get rid of as many of you guys as we can. And let's keep exploring. the item room. Miter, we will definitely take you. That will help us get spirit hearts. Might be too little too late, but you know, I will take it right now. And let us reroll the item room. What a shop. Compass. Yeah, we'll take the compass. That will help us, not on this floor, but on future floors, tell us where all the in rooms are and help us find the right way we need to do to get to the boss. Hoping there is an arcade on this floor. Because then I can gamble and potentially get some spirit hearts or some health. Because I have enough money here, I can definitely gamble. More health, excellent. And there's an arcade. Whew. Did not think I was gonna survive that. Stars and the moon. Keep the moon. Alright. Start gambling on you guys. Paid out already. Let's re-roll you. Theme sale do not want. But if we can do this to get us some health. Spirit heart. Alright. We now have something we can re-roll on. Spirit hearts, awesome. More money. More money. All 
Alright. Well, let us explore a little bit more. If we get rerolls, we'll come back and do that. We have the potential of turning that into the D6. If we turn that into the D6, we can then break this, which I've actually never broken before. It'll be interesting to see how that turns out. More money, alright. doing so much more damage now. More bombs. Alright, this is gonna be fun. Luckily I think that my tier, the poison sh hits them no matter what. So that will damage them, so that makes killing them a little bit more easier. Let's go reroll the steam cell. Vampire, don't want. Basically makes it so that as we kill enemies we regain health. Much better items I can use instead of that. Spirit heart out of it, nice, and a more heart. Cool. Let us go see if there is. I can't remember if I fully cleared this floor yet, so we'll see if we can get. One more recharge. It's to where the secret room might be. A couple locations. That is more than likely here. Nope. Is it here? Nope. And it could be here. Nope. Is it here? Yep. Money, all right. Now we have a lot of spirit hearts. Let us play the bud blank a little bit. See if we can get a reroll. Chocolate milk? No. Keeps eye now. And we got another blood bag. Alright. That takes us up to full health. Let us go fight mom. And we have our moon. Actually, let's take the stars. And then we'll take the moon after the fight. Because we'll warp out. 
And that will allow us to see if we got a devil room or not. So we have enough. Let's check you here real quick. Alright, warp to it. Oh, we got Gup Guppy's head. Cool, we can actually re-roll this. Brimstone? No. But we can re-roll it to get a deal with the devil item. Hmm. I wonder. So we are one, we're one third of the way to Guppy now. I could just take this mark right now. It should give me a good damage up, some some spirit hearts. Or I could keep trying to reroll to see if I can get more guppy items. I think we're just going to take you. Get our down to mark the pack. And we'll see if we get a deal with the devil after this. Bad dodging on my part. More bad dodging. I definitely like the po the poison damage on mom. No, I am taking some bad, stupid damage from mom. Let's see if we gotta deal with the devil. If not, we'll re-roll the spoon. Nope, alright, let's re-roll the spoon. Meet up. Awesome. Damage plus health up. That is good. Tears are much bigger now. Let's head down on down. Should have gone back to pick up the moon card, forgot, but that's okay. Curse of the Loss, alright. So we know we gotta head this way, let's just start heading towards the boss. I'm feeling in a much better position now. Granted, we are shooting a lot of tears with no orbital, but... You know, it is what it is. Hoping there would be like a library on this floor, which there isn't. Hopefully, we can get some more spirit hearts or not take any damage. I would like to eventually get a deal with. Oop. In room, how are we gonna do this? Can my attack flag at you? Actually, let us do like you. Cool, got a key, which is not really worth anything to us. through one of them easily. So they're gonna be in here. Bombs and keys, all right. Let's blow these up. One of them might be a tented rock. Nope. Oh, that was some good, good damage, or good dodging. Not sure how I survived it, but I did. Right, wait for all you guys to clear out. As well, 99 keys is always better than 98. And let us fight our boss now. We're fighting this guy, alright, this should be a pretty easy boss. 
need to make sure we don't make it too complicated. So far we're doing a good job of not. Kind of got ourselves in a nice little area here where we can't necessarily get hit. And that was close. And we did not get a deal with the devil, alright? So what do we want to do? I'm already at a lot of health. Let's re-roll you. Squeezy. It's going to be tears up plus two spirit hearts. I want to see if we can get something better. Damage up would be nice. chance it's here. No. Good chance you are here. No. Alright. Well, let's take Squeezy. Get the two hearts. And let's just... Wow, look how many tears we're doing. That's going to be dangerous against Isaac. But let us just go down the next floor. Hopefully Gish will slow him down quite a bit for us. No library again. There's a mini boss. Let's hopefully go this way. What are in here? Keys which we can't use. Stupid hit. Another stupid hit. So we lost the spirit hearts from Squeezy now. Flat penny. Stick with cancer. What is in here? Ooh, we can reroll this. Excellent. Secret room is. No, actually, we already know where the secret room is at, and greed is in it. Could try to greed farm. Last time I tried doing that, though, it didn't end too well for me. Keep my distance. Do you want to spawn some enemies, Creed? There we go. times. Alright, need him to spawn some more enemies. No. Spawn some more enemies, Greed. I'll do a couple more hits on you. 
That's where I gotta be careful. Took some damage. Don't die on me. Alright. Nope, nothing yet. Just do it a couple more times. Actually, well, next time. Oh. Yeah, let's just stop. Not gonna happen. can get anything. Ooh, and now I can't even go there. Awesome. Let's blow you guys up. So that was a waste. And I'm taking more damage. Tons of tears coming out. Much I could have done there. Child's heart. Let's keep cancer for now, just because they're gonna help me for a bit. Let's blow up you guys just in case to see if you're a tinted rock. Go fight at lives. Our tears are just tearing through people. Tears with the gish. Just let my poison damage take them out. Should be in constant shooting phase now. Cool, we got him. Let us just go to the next floor. Alright. Cursor room, but don't want to go to. Bad damage. Will I survive this? I have no idea. I need to get some more health coming up, I think, or else I'm gonna be dead. Luckily, block him. I right, had him locked. Until I decided not to be locked. Oh, there he goes, he's locked again. We got him. Cool. Definitely need some spirit hearts to start dropping. Spirit hearts and some tented rocks would be nice. Maybe that was not what I was looking for there. 
Alright, this might be our savior. Alright. Is that a sun car? Hermit. Alright. The bean. Alright. Let's re roll you. Ghost baby, alright. Some health to drop. Spirit heart, that's awesome. Two spirit hearts, very cool. Alright, let's go clear this floor a little bit more. See what we can find. That might give us some health. And or get some rerolls. Alright, this might be good. Let's set you aside here. And then set you here. And then set you here. I'm just worried I was going to blow it up, which apparently was not need to be worried about. Give me some good health here. Spirit hearts, excellent. I need to get myself a down a half a heart, or else the uh, scapular won't activate. Useless key. Right, more spirit hearts, awesome. Right, cheers up. It's gonna be dangerous. Health down. We will. I believe we save the health down until we are at. No, health down won't make a difference. Because it won't become a health up until we're down the one heart container. We need is we need a bad trip pill. But we got more pretty fly excellent. We got an orbital. Give us some health. Five cents, alright. At least it lets us to play you more. Spirit hearts there. This machine may have been our savior. Just in the amount of spirit hearts we're getting. Oh. Neither we didn't take damage, and it didn't destroy it, which was good. Every spirit heart is another chance that we'll survive. Pretty fly, awesome. So two pretty fly orbitals. More bombs. Oh, 
What are you? Maybe we don't know what this pill is, so let's find out. Speed up. Alright. Down to our last cent. Let's blow you up. Phew. Don't know how I did not take damage there. Let's check and see if you are a secret room. No? Alright. Let us explore a little bit more, see if we can get some more rerolls. We will definitely open up this golden chest. money. That's a health down pill. Bad dodging on my part. But we now have a reroll. I think that's spider. Quad shot. Slows down our tears a little bit, which is at least nice. What am I doing? I don't need a reroll anymore. Well, we're here how we are. Let's go give it a shot. Here we go. Let's see if we can do it. We need Gish to hit him. Yes, Gish hits him, which is nice. And then the poison is doing damage, which is good. Alright, phase one down. Now we're down to phase two. I think we got this. We got this. Hopefully we got it. Let's get him down. And then we'll focus on the angel babies. We got it! Let's grab the spirit heart. Let's open up the chest. Hopefully we'll see after this there, it should hopefully show the Polaroid completed. It does! Excellent! Now I don't know if this means I have to beat it again to unlock the Polaroid, or if now I have the Polaroid fully unlocked. Well, let me take a look at the uh, statistics. Secrets found. A little gish. Alright. So we've gotten that now, so I think now next time I beat, uh, I beat It Lives, I should get the Polaroid. So cool! So everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you did, please like the video. It really does help me out a lot. If you enjoy watching Isaac videos in Europa Universal Force, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. You can also follow me on Twitter at Hilldog1378. Thanks everybody for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.